Okay, world, this is a uh, uh, 03 model uh, Goodman slash Janitrol 3.5 ton uh, condensing unit. I'm um, going to show you what a blown capacitor looks like. Uh, when you go in the cabinet, make sure you uh, pull the disconnect on the wall first so you got no power. Short your uh, terminals on the toss top of your capacitor. This capacitor right here. Uh, short your capacitor across the terminals with a screwdriver to discharge any residual voltage inside the capacitor. And then uh, look for oil, like we have oil right here. I don't know if you can see it, but we have some oil right there, kind of dripping uh, brown stuff in there. That's why you do not want to ch If the condenser fan motor is not running, I'll always check for a capacitor being uh, kind of blown. Looks like somebody put an explosive inside the thing. Sometimes they'll be just round, like it should be flat on the top here. Uh, this top area all the way around the whole inside of this thing should be flat. Uh, this thing is looks like exploded inside and it has oil leaking down the side of the capacitor where you can see this residual brown stuff. Uh, anyhow, let's see if we can kind of get a picture of the oil a little bit. Uh, maybe. Guess, uh, anyways, this is uh, one of those double capacitors commonly used by Carrier. Uh, first one I've seen on a Goodman. Didn't know Goodman was using uh, the double capacitor. They run their uh, common here, and then your fan here, fan cap and uh, compressor, all in the same capacitor. In my opinion, bad idea. Too many things going on in one in one box. Uh, Optimal replacement would be to uh, split them up, put two separate caps, and uh, but sometimes for space, this thing doesn't have the space probably, so probably just use the same cap, throw it back in, throw it back online, away you go. Um, so there you go, world. That's what. Uh, anyways, uh, they look like exploded on the top, kind of blown.